So I think today was, a, it was definitely a success and a fantastic day. So we had over a thousand uh, professionals walk in the door uh, that came to hear a range of different sort of topics. That the very capabilities and technologies that are delivering this productivity are the very ones that can take it down as well. Don't forget, successful companies already know how to manage significant risks. Cybersecurity is relevant for everybody, from people at home, people in small business, people in large business. Uh, I think it's relevant right across the board and I think what people are getting out of today is some, some great information, not just to uh, relevant to a product, um, but what they need to do from a people and a process perspective as well. I then officially launched the Navigate the Digital Age, the Australian edition. This is um, you know, kind of a how-to guide for senior executive boards of directors, government officials, and how to think about cybersecurity in a non-technical fashion uh, along the lines of how are we doing, how do I measure it, how to speak to their staffs in a way that everybody can understand. The response of the guide has been great, a lot of people grabbing it, I mean it's, it's walking off the shelf itself, but um, you know it's really nice to see an Aussie version too, so uh, you know it's obviously very, very specific to the market. So with the guide it gives us the ammunition to be able to equip the leaders of our businesses to really understand what's going. Um, cybersecurity can be quite an abstract concept, I think, for some if it's new. Um, this is going to help us explain exactly what's going on. Seven of the ten authors that we actually had, our contributing authors, come up on stage. We had Forbes, the Chief Insight Officer, moderate the panel. And it was great conversation, great dialogue, and really just sharing some of that you know, key learnings as to what people need to start thinking about, especially at that sort of C-level and Board of Directors. Safety is not just, just a good metaphor for, for cyber. It's where actually those two worlds intersect. I think we've got to take a broad, not a narrow approach to that awareness. It's got to be about teaching people to think and, and locking into a different set of values because that's actually going to build the trust. Great conversation, a lot of discussion around prevention and how they can connect into our you know, threat prevention environment. And it's good to get an insight into you know, what other cybersecurity experts. There's been a lot of focus on how cybersecurity is actually a business problem not only just a technology problem, it's a message that we've been working with within our organisation for quite a while and it's good to hear that that message is getting out beyond the four walls that I've been involved in. I think the feedback that we've got so far at least has been that you, know, you are doing something different in the market, you are trying to, to raise the stakes, make sure that business leaders are empowered uh, and they are being sort of you know, made aware of what's actually going on and what they need to be doing in their own businesses.